Hello everyone. Today, I have another awesome tutorial for you. In this video, I'm going to show you how to build a simple and reliable regulator for your motorcycle. As you know, regulators play a crucial role in motorcycles, and if they don't work properly, they can cause serious problems. So don't miss this video. Join me in this DIY project. Here I have a burned out regulator and I want to use it as a circuit box. To do this, I first empty out the inside completely. Let's go. It's done. All right, let's get start on building uh, the regulator circuit. Stay with me. To build this regulator, we need these campaigns. Alright, our regulator is ready. Now we can seal it in inside the box with the resin glue. But before I do that, 
Let's test it and see how it works. In AC stators, we have a twin pot, usually white or pink and yellow color. White to white and yellow to yellow. The green one is a negative or ground and the red is a charging output. First I'll test it the output with a 12 volt lump. One side to ground. And one side to output. This is my bench test. As you can see, the light is steady and stable. It's nice. Now let's measure the output voltage with the multimeter. Set the multimeter in AC volt and negative to negative and positive to output it's great the charging voltage is perfect. Now uh, let's test it with a 12 volt battery and see it charging or not. Set the multimeter on the DC volts and install the battery to the circuit. Positive connect to output and negative go to ground. As you can see, the batteries charge. This is a battery voltage. Okay, let's go test it. Great, the charging voltage is also excellent. As you can see, we've built a very simple and perfect regulator. Now, let's go to packing.
All right, friends, this tutorial has come to an end. This was a simple example of one of the most basic motorcycle regulators. The maximum output current is about five amps, making it suitable for single cylinder, two stroke and four stroke engines with an AC stator. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like it and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell for more videos. Until the next tutorial, take care.